everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Philly Beats You, and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to get hidden ability on every single Pokemon in the game. That also includes legendary Pokemon. If you're pumped for this video, make sure to leave a like, and if you're new to the channel, subscribe for crazy content like this. And without further ado, let's get on into the video so you can know how to get every Pokemon's hidden ability in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. So I'm gonna first talk about the three ways that you can't get hidden ability Pokemon. The first one is the Grand Underground Pokemon have egg moves that you can't normally find in the Pokemon. That's the benefit of the Grand Underground and it is not hidden ability Pokemon at all. So please do not make that mistake when you go down there thinking you'll be able to find a hidden ability Pokemon. The next thing to note is that if you just run into a patch of grass, you will not get a hidden ability Pokemon. They do not spawn that way. The only way they spawn is going to be the first method that we're going to be talking about in this video. Randomly getting hidden ability Pokemon from egg hatches from parents that don't even have hidden ability is another miscommon myth. So if I get a regular Pokemon with no hidden ability, put it with the ditto, there's no random chance or super rare secret chance that you will be getting a hidden ability Pokemon. It's just not going to happen. Let's go take a look at the actual methods of how to get hidden ability Pokemon. So the first way to get hidden ability Pokemon is by using the Poke Radar, which will allow you to hunt in the grass. The only problem with this method is that you're only limited to whatever Pokemon are allowed to be there via Poke Radar or directly on that route using the Poke Radar. Now, when you're Poke Radar hunting, you have to see the grass move in a certain way to 100% confirm that that is a hidden ability Pokemon. The patch of grass on the left is a regular Pokemon grass shape. The patch on the right side of the screen is a hidden ability patch. As you can see, it moves way more violently and shakes a lot more than the one on the left. Okay, so let's go encounter this Pokemon. It is a Nidoran. So I'm just gonna throw a Pokeball. And we got it. And now checking the ability, it says that it has Hustle which is exactly its hidden ability, which boosts the attack stat, but lowers accuracy. The regular abilities that it has are Poison Point or Rivalry, but this is Hustle, and it worked. The next way to get hidden ability Pokemon is absolutely broken. What you're gonna have to do is fly over to the post-game island, the fight area. So once you're there, just go ahead and follow me. We're gonna go up this pathway into this building, continue to head up north in the battle park, This building is known as the Battle Tower, and in the Battle Tower, you'll be able to do single and double battles, and you will be able to earn a lot of points known as BP. You're then going to be spending this BP after doing a lot of battles on certain items. Once you've farmed up a lot of battle points, you're then going to exit this area, head down from the Battle Park, and enter this building right before that. Go up these steps and you're going to have two counters. The counter to your right is where you're going to be able to get TMs and the counter to your left is where you're going to get items. Now, as you can see here, there's two different things. There's an ability capsule and an ability patch. The ability capsule allows your Pokemon to switch between the two abilities. So if you wanted to change your Pokemon's ability, this is what you get. If you want to get the ability patch, this one is the most expensive item out of all the battle points. It costs 200, but it says a patch that allows a Pokemon with a regular ability to have a rare ability. So what we're going to do is we're going to buy one. So I wanted to try this out on a legendary Pokemon, the box one, Dialga, and its ability currently is Pressure, which is the base one you get in the game. And it just says by putting a pressure on the opposing Pokemon, it raises their PP usage. So I'm going to go ahead, go to my items, go into my bag. We're going to grab the ability patch, use this item, and I'm going to try to change Dialga's ability it actually changed dialgo's ability is now telepathy so we're going to go back into the pokemon menu and we're going to take a look at dialgo and checking its summary the no longer pressure and it says anticipates an ally's attack and dodges it the reason why i wanted to show you dialgo is to prove that we could even change legendary pokemon's abilities to hidden abilities i don't think you guys realize how big of a deal this is that we can change any pokemon's ability to their hidden ability. The fact that we can even do it to legendary Pokemon is huge. That means you have the opportunity to do that to all 493 Pokemon in the game and get their hidden ability. Not only that, but then when you start breeding your Pokemon with Ditto, they can start passing down that hidden ability. So I wanted to try this out with a Torchic that I got in the Grand Underground. And if you wanna know where to catch all these Pokemon, make sure to check out the Grand Underground video over here. This Torchic that I have currently has Blaze, which powers up fire type moves when the Pokemon's HP is low. And a lot of you guys know that Torchic 
Torchic has a hidden ability move known as Speed Boost. And now we have Speed Boost on our Torchic. That is freaking insane. Okay, but now I want to breed it. So we're going to go inside of the daycare. I'm going to give the Pokemon Nursery Lady my Ditto and Torchic. Okay, come back for them later. Let's go make some eggs. So I got my five eggs over here from the daycare center. And my Dialga is not a flame body, but it's the only Pokemon I had at the moment to use for this video. So Dialga and five eggs. This is not going to be very efficient, but here we go. Let's do this. Okay, after so many steps, my eggs are ready to hatch. Torchic number one. My hand hurts so much from like spitting on my controller. Torchic number two. Torchic number three. Wait, no! Stop! Oh my god! No way! Okay, so speed boost has passed on to the next generation and I got super lucky with speed boost on the shiny Torchic. Now listen, if for some reason, I can't believe this happened in the tutorial, this for some reason was a shiny Torchic and it had the regular ability, you would just have to add the ability patch on it anyway. Don't mind me, I'm just walking through town with my shiny Torchic. Also, I just realized because my Dialga had the Pokerus, my Torchic ended up catching the Pokerus from Dialga while being in the egg. So when it hatched, it's literally a level one shiny with Pokerus and it has speed boost. This is the greatest Torchic on the planet. All right, so now you guys are experts on how to get hidden ability Pokemon. So the only real benefit of Poke Radar is to get exclusive Pokemon that you will not find anywhere else but in the Poke Radar spawn pool. The second method is really simple. Just get an ability patch and put it on your Pokemon. The only problem is that you have to go through a lot of battles in order to do that. So while it may sound easy in application, you do have to have a team and do a lot of grinding in order to do that. But the rewards of once you have that ability patch is definitely worth it. And you guys are now also experts at hidden ability Pokemon breeding. And you now know that it's not a random chance, but rather you must have a hidden ability Pokemon in order to breed a hidden ability Pokemon. So make sure to share this video with everyone out there who doesn't really understand hidden ability Pokemon and you can let them know that Philly Beats You told you how to get every single hidden ability Pokemon in the game which is actually insane. The other crazy thing about hidden ability Pokemon is that now you have leverage when it comes to trading with other people to get what you want and if you want to do some trading head over to our discord and we can have a hidden ability chat specifically for those Pokemon. But that's all I have to say about hidden ability Pokemon. Let me know what you guys think about hidden ability Pokemon and which one you're going to specifically get. My name is Philly Beats You. Thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next video. I'm out. Peace.